Hello students, in this presentation we are going to see what is linearly independent vector and linearly dependent vector. Before that we shall see what is linear combination of vector. Let V be a vector space over a field F and S be a non-empty subset of V non-empty subset in the sense we collect some a few vectors from this vector space V. A vector V in the capital V is called a linear combination of vectors in S. If there exists U1, U2, etc. Un in capital S and some scalars like alpha1, alpha2, etc. alpha n taken from this field F such that B can be written as sum of like alpha 1 u1, alpha 2 u2, etc. alpha n u n. So alpha 1 u1, alpha 2 u2, etc. alpha n u n are all put in addition. So when we are able to expl express these u's as a single vector and that can be named as a V, then we can call this V as a linear combination of u1, u2, etc., un. It is clear in the graph, this w can be written as a linear combination of u and v, with some scalars like 2 times u and 3 times v. Linear span. Let s be a non-empty subset of the vector space V over a field F. Then the set of all linear combination of a finite sets of elements of S is called a linear span of S, which means all the linear combination vectors put in a single set we call that as a linear span of S. And this is denoted as L of S or span of S. Next definition is linearly independent. Let V be a vector space over a field F. A finite number of vectors taken from this vector space V are called linearly independent over the field F. If there exist scalars alpha 1, alpha 2, etc., alpha n, all are 0 in F such that alpha 1 v1 plus etc alpha n vn equal to 0. So scalars multiplied with vectors on adding all n vectors v, it yields a 0 only if all the scalars are 0. In such case the vectors are called linearly independent. In the graph it is clearly visible that these two vectors u and v are independent. Here too in the plane, all the three vectors are independent. Next definition is linearly dependent. Let V be a vector space over a field F. A finite number of vectors V1, V2, etc., Vn are called linearly dependent over the field F. If there exist scalars n, scalars, not all the scalars are 0 in F such that alpha 1 v1 plus etc alpha n vn equal to 0. So in the graph it is clear that one vector lies on the other vector. In that case we can say v is dependent on u or u is dependent on v. The same way when three vectors lies on the same plane we call those vectors as dependent vectors. Thank you.